Hey everyone, welcome to the first episode of the new Nemesis Presents Till All Are One. Now, I've been a Transformer fan for many, many years, and actually my original main channel started with me doing Transformer reviews, unboxing videos and stuff of Transformers, some of which and many of which have been deleted at this point because of the COPPA rule. I was really scared that those videos were going to be labeled as kid videos and it was going to demonetize my whole channel. So I ended up deleting all those videos, which I do regret, obviously, because I found out that that probably wouldn't have been the case on, uh, on many levels. Uh, so that's a bummer that I lost those. But hey, my own dumb fault for not doing enough research. Uh, but I always wanted to do more stuff with Transformers. And one of the things that I was kicking around for a while was diving into Transformers on this channel because they don't really get a lot of views on my main channel, but on this channel, I've played Transformer games like War of Cybertron, Fall of Cybertron, um, Devastation, um, and then I think the Rise of the Dark Spark. Uh, we've played all those games on this channel and also on my Twitch channel, and uh, and I know I have a, more of a gaming audience over here, and so I thought, what if you know we do this? We cover this new Transformer game that's coming out, which I was watching the Game Awards when this was happening, which is such a boring thing, the Game Awards, but it was just, there was nothing else to do that day. And I just found myself turning it on on YouTube and watching it. And I kicked it on about five minutes before this trailer showed up. And when this trailer showed up, I was like, what is this? This looks kind of neat. And then when I saw the hand, I was like, whoa, that's, and it's tall. Like, so then I was trying to think of all the games that had like mechs in them or robots in them. And then when it showed Transformers, I was like, you're kidding me. Because uh, this has been rumored for a while. I think this game has gone through a couple different names, but it's been rumored for a while. And there's even leaked, you know, cutscenes and concept art and things like that. I don't want to, you know, really discuss those because um, I don't know if any of that's true or if any of it's, you know, any of that's changed probably. If those are still the same cutscenes or if they if they were just the beginning animatics and they're going to CGI the cutscenes, I imagine. So there's just a lot of things I'm like, well, I don't want to cover that. I just want to show off the images from this trailer and and kind of show you like uh, the stuff that is confirmed and then go right to the website, which is where I'm at right now and read the information here, which is um, the synopsis, which says the gravest threat to humanity has arrived and it's already won. Earth is no longer ours and it belongs to them. All we have left is our hope for the Autobots as we salvage them from the rubble left behind. Transformers Reactivate is a one to four player online action game developed by Splash Damage, uh, coming to PC and consoles. With the closed beta planned for 2023, players, press, and content creators can sign up at the links below for further updates, which I did. So if there's any chance we get picked for a beta or anything like that, and we're allowed to stream it, I will definitely do that and bring those episodes here to this channel. And we will also dive into a comic book series called Transformers Generation 2, which I have every issue of because the enemy of this sounds like the swarm. It's a different take on them, I think, but it's like a hive mind enemy where there's a bunch of drones that all think the same, kind of like the Borg from Star Trek, and they're atta they've are they already attacked Earth in one, and the war is over. So in this game, I think Autobots and Decepticons, the ones that survived, are now teaming up to fight back against this enemy threat that is coming to wipe out everything and completely take over this planet. So there's some humans that have resisted, that have been staying alive, and they're doing it by salvaging robots and trying to get them to join their cause. And so there is some characters out there that have been, I think, leaked or rumored where you can play as like Bumblebee and I think Starscream and I think a couple other characters. So this could be really fun. And it being four player co-op, that would be awesome if it's something like Left for Dead in a way or something, or just like, uh, or even like Gears of War, where there's a couple of different characters and you play as them and you're moving through with single objectives and stuff and taking over areas. That could be a lot of fun. So I'm interested to see more from this that is like actually confirmed. But right now you can go to the website, you can sign up. They they send out like, there's like a press thing. So I downloaded that and it has like the graphics and stuff. That's how I was able to make the logo for this show. Um, but there's a lot of cool Transformer stuff I'm gonna do on this show. We'll look at some of the toys. Uh, I have a lot of the Bumblebee Studio Series movie toys. I have some of the recent legacy character toys, including Geaxis who is from the Generation 2 comic book that we'll be talking about. So we're going to dive into a lot of Transformer stuff. And once again, like I did with Resident Evil, and like what we're going to kind of try to do with uh, Silent Hill with 21 Sacraments, we're going to try to do 100 episodes of Transformer stuff. So we'll talk about everything from some cartoon episodes and movies to the, you know, the video games to the G Generation 2 comic book series. And we're going to restrict it to just that comic series because there's so much lore in comic books out there for Transformers that there's no way I could cover it all and get it all done in 100 episodes. There's just no way. So we're going to just focus on Generation 2 because that sounds like it has a storyline that resembles a little bit of this one where characters that you didn't think would have to team up do against a common threat. 
Uh, so I'm I'm very excited that this game is going to be a lot of fun. We're also not just toys and stuff like that, but we're going to talk about Magic the Gathering. Uh, there are some boxes that we got recently. Um, one of my alters has taken a liking to Magic and wants to use that to go out and make friends uh, on Friday Night Magic events that I guess happen. Um, so, and Magic's something I was interested at one point and kind of got lost interest pretty quickly. But uh, he seems really adamant about playing it. And once he saw Transformers were added, he got all excited. So there will be some unboxing videos where he's like opening up packs and stuff like that and looking through them that will show off. And we'll, we'll, so we'll have a lot of different styles of content for this show in particular, uh, more so than all, every other show. Because a lot of my other shows is me talking to the camera, but we're going to have gameplay footage on this show. You know, we're going to have uh, looking at comic books with a top down view. We're going to be looking at cards, you know, through a top down view. Like there's going to be different things we're going to bring to this show. So I hope you enjoy. And if you're a Transformer fan, make sure you subscribe and stay tuned. And if you have any requests for things that are in the wheelhouse of what I talked about, let me know and I'll try to squeeze those in as future episodes for sure. So thank you so much. Let me know what you think of Reactivate. I'm waiting to hear more information on this game, but for right now, I'm very, very excited for it. Um, a full one to four player game is gonna be awesome. I'm glad that it's one to four player and that it's not mandatory. You have to play multiplayer because some days I just wanna unwind and destroy Decepticons on my own. And then other days I, I would love to team up and communicate with people um, and do it that way too and, and, and link up with friends. Um, but then also I'm replaying uh, the Fall of Cybertron video game and I'll have footage of that coming up in future episodes and we'll do a breakdown of that video game because that's one of my favorite Transformer games out there. So again, variety. We're going to have toys, video games, comic books. We're going to have a lot of different stuff on this show. So I hope you stay tuned and I hope you enjoy. So thanks so much for watching the show. As always, like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I'll see you on Cybertron. Peace. Oh, oh, oh.